What is up? This is your LA in a Minute, and you know I'm a fan of LA City Schools. And there's an unprecedented three LAUSD City Section teams playing for state championships in football this weekend. Banning, Birmingham, and Fairfax all have a chance to take home LAUSD's first state title since 2017. Let's get into it. So in an era of transfers and recruiting making life difficult on LAUSD City Section schools, the city hasn't come up with a state title since 2017 when they won two. Crenshaw beat Placer 46-43 in the Division 4 AA championship, and Narbonne won the Division 1A title after they defeated Pittsburgh of Northern California 28-21 after erasing a 21-point deficit. But since then, City Section teams are 0-8 in their quest to win a state title, including two losses last year, one by Granada Hills in the 4A final in a rainy 32-8 loss to San Marin and a gutty inspirational loss by Crenshaw in the 7A final against Lincoln of San Francisco, where they were only able to dress 23 active players. But City Section powerhouse Birmingham looks to reverse that trend as they take on Akalanis in the 3AA final on Saturday at Saddleback College at 11.30 a.m. Birmingham has won 42 consecutive games against City Section teams under head coach Jim Rose. And with quarterback Kingston Tisdale throwing to all-everything wide receiver Peyton Waters, Birmingham stands a good chance in this matchup. Banning will take on Woodland Christian in the 5A final on Saturday at El Camino at 3 p.m. Benning is a tough team, coached by Raymond Grajeda, and they keep the ball on the ground, having piled up 406 yards rushing on 65 attempts, compared to only one pass attempt last weekend in the game to get him to the state final. And in a matinee game at 4 p.m. on Friday at El Camino College, Fairfax will take on Ferndale High for the chance to be the 7AA state champions. Fairfax won the City Division II championship behind quarterback Ivan Levant, who threw for a touchdown in the final minutes. So it's been a long time coming for the City section, but the LAUSD is ready to take home one, two, or even three state championships this weekend. All right, LA, it's been a minute.